Hello Mark, so this is a quick tutorial to teach you how to edit your um, slideshow image and gallery uh, gallery image that you will have uh, here. Alright, let's start with the uh, slideshow. So slideshow, very simple, when you are in the back office, just go in slides here, then you'll see there's a list of slides, that's the three slides that are actually um, showing up here on the home page. So the only thing you have to change here is just click whatever slides you want to edit. You can change here uh, the text. So if you that like those tags are HTML tags. Not sure if you know what that means. Basically, B means bold. Uh, H2 means it's a title tag, so it it will show up a little bit like um, um, big and br it means break right? it's line break so you will have a line break after this uh, so b uh, there's always opening and closing tag so it's bold bold and h2 h2 line break obviously there's no uh, closing tag because it's just one action to do there's nothing to wrap up around and so you can change, like if you're not comfortable changing the tags, just change what you understand, right? Just change the text here and, and here. And you can just change the picture here by clicking there and select a new file from your computer or select an existing file from your um, server. All right. So, and you can do this and what, once you are done, click on update. So you can do that for all the three slides and you can add new slides, right? If you click add new, then you will have a new slide and you can have like, right now you have three slides, but you can have a, a fourth one, fifth one, if you need, if you want to. All right, that's uh, the slideshow and uh, the mm, gallery, so the gallery are for like, in, th there's two options to manage gallery. I would say the easiest way is to go here, Meta Gallery. So if you click on Meta Gallery, you see there's already some, some gallery showing up here. And then we just copy paste this short code into the page. So let's say you want to create a new gallery for whatever, like a, let's say some July, July uh, white tail, uh, white tail beer. There's a typo here. White tail deer. Alright. Let's say you want to create a new uh, gallery. Alright, so you just uh, click here, add image gallery. Let's say uh, it's a uh, summer gallery. And then you just have to uh, select the images here that you want. So, gallery image. Let's say we want this image, this image, this image. So I'm hitting Control, Control key to select more than one images. So here you see there's one, two, three, four, five uh, selected images. Clicking on Add to Gallery. And then I just click on Publish. And when I go back here, I got my summer gallery, uh, my I got a slider ID here or a carousel. So let's say I want to display a carousel. I just copy paste the short code here. So I uh, right click, copy. And now let's say I want to add this gallery on the about us page. So I go in about us. I will go in visual builder. And I will uh, create just a simple uh, WordPress text uh, here. I'm just copying, co like pasting the, uh, the gallery, clicking save here, and that's it. Okay. Now I will just click on upgrade. Oh, sorry, <laughs> that's not what I wanted to do. So do not click on upgrade, click on updates, sorry. Okay, and I can click on preview and see what, what it looks like. 
and here you see got my carousel uh, showing up here properly okay so you can you can create as many gallery as you want you can stack them into one page you can create um, specific page for specific gallery uh, very I mean it's pretty convenient let's say you want to create a new page that's something I forgot to cover um, if you want to create a new page and attach it to your menu here you just need to go into pages here page just click on add new click test I mean you can uh, enter whatever the, the name of the, the page you want to add uh, click on publish so now you got a new page but you but it's not attached to any uh, menu item here so if you want to add it to attach it to a menu item you need to go in appearance and menus appearance menus and from here you need to select uh, the header menu select and from here you just uh, select the page that you've just created test click on add to menu it will show up here at the bottom and I can move it around you'll see that the uh, if I put it on the blog here so you see there's a little space it means blog is the parent item for test if I click save here the test link will show up right below blog okay if you want to have another like top level menu item you just need to put it right here okay and you will see like it will show up right there okay so um, I think that's pretty much it uh, obviously I will not save this so I will remove that and I will remove what I've done on the pages so I think you pretty much set up to handle everything by yourself so just let me know if you have any question regarding the sites and uh, we'll go from there thank you Mark